Crowned Eagle versus Harpy Eagle. Who do you think would win a fight between these two powerful raptors? Crowned Eagle and Harpy Eagle are some of the most powerful eagles in the world. Although one lives in Africa and the other in South America, if they end up fighting, who do you think will win? Stay tuned and we'll find out the answer to this question together. The crowned eagle is also known as the African crowned eagle, dubbed the most powerful eagle in Africa. The crowned eagle symbolizes honesty, majesty, strength, courage and freedom and is believed by many to have a special connection to God. Harpy eagles, also known as American harpy eagles, are the largest species of rainforest dwelling raptors. These great birds are named after harpies, the predatory, frightful flying creatures with hooked beak and claws of Greek mythology. Size and Description Crowned eagles are typically eagle-like in shape, with rounded heavy wings, large talons and densely feathered legs. They have small faces with large crested swept back feathers. The eagle's head itself is usually dark brown. The torso has dark underparts and a striking spotted breast and thighs. Their bodies are quite lengthy compared to other eagles. Crowned eagles are nevertheless very large and powerful eagles with particularly strong thighs and are revered for being amongst the most beautiful of eagles in terms of their plumage. The length of the eagle from head to talons is 32 to 38 inches, 80 to 95 centimeters. The wingspan is 5 to 7 feet, 1.5 to 2.1 meters, and weighs 5.5 to 9.9 .9 pounds, 2.5 to 4.5 kilograms, where females reach the top edge, being heavier than males. The harpy eagle is the largest and most powerful raptor found in the rainforest and among the largest extant species of eagles in the world. The upper side of the harpy eagle is covered with slate black feathers and the underside is mostly white. The head is pale grey and is crowned with a double crest. The upper side of the tail is black with three grey bands while the underside of it is black with three white bands. The iris is grey or brown or red, the sear and bill are black or blackish, and the tarsi and toes are yellow. They usually are in the range of somewhere between 35 and 41 inches long, 88 to 104 centimeters. Female harpy eagles tend to be significantly bigger than males. The weight range for the females is between 14 and 20 pounds, 6.3 to 9 kilograms, while the range for the males is between 8.5 and 12 pounds, 3.8 to 5.4 kilograms. Harpy eagle's wingspan is about 7 feet, 2.13 meters. Range and habitat. The crowned eagle lives in Africa its range ranging from East Africa, Southern Kenya and Uganda, Tanzania, Northern Mozambique, Malawi, Zimbabwe and the Democratic Republic of Congo. It also extends to Liberia and Senegal in West Africa. But here the population is more fragmented due to habitat loss. In the south, they can reach as far east as South Africa. The densest population is found in the forests of East Africa. The crowned eagle inhabits dense forests, sometimes plantations, heavily wooded hillsides, dense woodland and rocky outcrops throughout its range, at an altitude of up to 11,000 feet. Owing to a lack of suitable habitat through deforestation and industrialization, the eagle's range is discontinuous. These eagles are naturally found from Mexico to South America, as far south as Argentina. Unfortunately, most of the eagles in Mexico and Central America have been exterminated due to deforestation. The only area in which they are readily found in Central America is parts of Panama. 
The highest population density is found in Brazil. Harpy eagles usually inhabit the canopy layer of tropical lowland rainforests. Despite their size, they are fast, nimble flyers and usually hunt in forested areas. Harpy eagles usually live below 900 meters, but occur locally as high as 2,000 meters, preferring large expanses of uninterrupted lowland tropical forest. They will also hunt in open areas adjacent to forest patches. Food Habits Crowned eagles hunt a lot like leopards. They rely on stealth to get close, then accelerate at speed towards their prey. Their talons are so strong, they can crush the skull of a 30-kilogram antelope. In one swoop, they can snap the spine of an animal up to seven times its weight. Such sharp talons usually kill prey on impact. If not, the animal dies from asphyxiation or soon passes out from its injuries. Crowned eagles hunt in pairs. The male or female distracts the troop with some ferocious flapping, then the killer glides in undetected to deliver a killer blow. Those distributed in the rainforest regularly hunt primates, including monkeys, baboons, and possibly even baby chimpanzees. Crowned eagles in more open arid terrain hunt antelope, hyraxes, bushbucks, and pygmy hippos. Other prey includes pigs and boar, large reptiles, other birds, pangolins, and squirrels. A raptor's feet determine what it eats. One look at a harpy eagle's foot leaves no doubt that these birds are built for hunting good-sized prey. Their powerful legs and feet and long, sharp talons are designed to catch prey that would be off-limits for most other birds. Their rear talons are about 3 to 4 inches long, 7.6 to 10.1 centimeters, the same size as a grizzly bear's claws. Harpy eagle's diet can include iguanas, parrots, porcupines, cotamundis, and raccoons. They have even been seen preying on black vultures and foxes. Although they prefer to hunt high up in the trees, they will hunt ground-dwelling animals, including javelina, armadillos, and agoutis. Even though harpy eagles are adapted to hunting large prey animals, they still have to be very careful. After all, it isn't only the predators that are equipped with good defenses. Behavior Crowned eagles live in pairs. They are largely sedentary and usually inhabit a fixed territory throughout the year. Crowned eagles are considered nervous, constantly alert, and on edge. Crowned eagles may hunt alone or in pairs, and mainly kill early in the morning and in the evening prior to sundown. Crowned eagles are highly vocal and have a noisy, undulating display fight. Territorial displays consist of a series of steep dives and ascents with a few wing flaps at the top of each climb and descending circles and figures of eight. During this display, the male is noisy while throwing his head back. Harpies are highly territorial and require several square miles of rainforest to survive and reproduce. They protect their territory from other eagles allowing them to have a consistent food source. Pairs of eagles will mate for life and nest in the same territory. Females take most of the responsibility with raising the chicks, but males also participate. Both harpy parents will viciously defend their young from predators. Now it's time for the fight, so let's find out together who will win in a one-on-one -on -one battle. A crowned eagle or a harpy eagle. Even though the lifestyles of these two eagles are similar, as they both live in the rainforests for the most part, there are some pretty big differences between them. Both birds are considered to be some of the most powerful birds of prey, being among the largest. As for their size, it is clear that harpy eagle will win here. The size of harpy eagles is almost double the size of crowned eagles. Even in this case, 
it is known that crowned eagles are very strong compared to their size. They are the strongest eagles in Africa, although martial eagles are larger in size. The crowned hawk eagle is strong enough to be able to kill an antelope up to six times its own mass. However, I still think that a fair fight would be between a male harpy eagle and a female crowned eagle. But even though they are mostly the same size, I think this is where the size of the heels comes in. Talons of harpy eagle are the largest of all birds of prey, almost equal to those of the grizzly bear. Even if the talons of the crowned eagle are quite large, it will be dominated by the harpy eagle. Aerial combat is not all about weight advantage. It mainly involves maneuverability as well as weaponry, in my opinion. And here I think they'll both do pretty well. I think if it were the same size, the aggressiveness of the crowned eagle would probably match the size of its harpy eagle's talons. But as the harpy eagle is often much bigger, he will definitely win. What do you think about this fight? I'm waiting for your opinion. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, farewell.